Oliver's cheating on me. I don't think so. Well, that's what I would have said before I saw this picture. I need to know something. Baby, you already know everything. Hey, you just proved that. Was that amazing just because it was amazing or because it's been a long, cold month? Month and a half, which, for the record, I will never, mm -hmm. ever, ever let happen again. Stop. I miss you. Mm, stop, 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 stop. I'm sorry, did you say something? I can't, <laughs> I can't hear anything. No, Cutter, seriously, listen. Joey could be back from the hospital any minute. Yeah, he could be gone till morning. Can you leave a number? By the phone. Yeah, hi. Uh, I'm asking for... Uh, ask for maternity. Uh, maternity, please. Yeah, no, I'm, uh, I need to check the status of a patient scheduled for a C-section. What are you going to do? What am I going to do? Why should I do anything? You don't care if there's something going on with this guy? Really, I assume Aubrey had a life before she met me. I mean, say you were dating somebody new and they came across an old picture of us. What do you say? You'd say it doesn't mean anything. We're over. This isn't an old picture. Didn't you read the caption? No. Well, you see, it was taken in Europe at the end of November. Here is the date, if you want to look. Oh, that's impossible. Why? This is when I flew back here. Aubrey was supposed to be with me, but she took a later flight because... because she said she was sick. It looks pretty healthy to me. <sighs> Think maybe when it's just the two of us, I'll take that off. And let you get me so distracted that I forget to put it back on? It's just a little sparkle. It doesn't mean anything. It means something to Joey Buchanan. He thinks you're marrying him. And I'm not. So what's the problem? The problem is, it was never supposed to get this far. We've done this before, we know how it's supposed to go. You do your thing, guy falls like a ton of bricks, you get the account numbers, give them to me. I do my thing, done. We're miles away before he even knows he's been cleaned out. Joey surprised me with the proposal. What was I supposed to say, no? I don't like it. Yeah, well, neither does his family. I mean, his mom's warming up a little bit, but his dad totally pegged me as a gold digger. He's right. Yeah, well, Joey doesn't know that. You should see how he defends me. It's actually kind of sweet. Don't let it get to your head. What do you mean? I didn't know better. I swear you were starting to care about the guy. You know, Aubrey was sick on New Year's Eve, too. She couldn't get up to her room fast enough for this. What is your point? That maybe she didn't want anyone stumbling on this picture. So you made it your business to go out and get another copy just for me. Gee, thanks, Kel. I'm glad you went to all that trouble just to throw it back in my face. You really don't think I'm getting hung up on Joey, do you? Rule number one, never fall for the mark. And I never have. But as marks go, Joey's not so bad. You know these rich guys, they're all ego all the time. But Joey's not like that. He's an actual human being. Okay. So he gets the Nobel Prize for nice. Don't feel sorry for the guy. Who could feel sorry for a guy that hot? I'm kidding. I'm kidding! Better be. Stop it, Cutter. You know I love you. I love you, too. We're in this together, and we don't need any more complications. Well, I think we might already have one. What? Not what. Who? Joey's ex, Kelly Kramer. I was in the middle of an article that I wanted to finish, and uh, yeah, I, I grabbed another magazine, and that's when I came across the picture, totally by accident. Okay, and, and running to give it to me. That was by accident, too. Well, I thought you would want to know. I don't get it. I am trying to help you, Joey. I am your friend. Yo, yo, you're my friend. Then why are you trying to torpedo my relationship? Did my father put you up to this? Your father? Yeah, he'd do just about anything to get me to change my mind about Aubrey. Joey, this, this isn't a conspiracy. I'm not working with someone. I saw something that worried me. 
and I didn't want you to get hurt. So you tell me that my fiance is cheating on me and you don't think it's going to hurt? Well, guess what? It doesn't. No, 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 because I trust Aubrey, and there has to be at least a half dozen explanations for this picture. Oh, really? I can't imagine what they could be. Kelly, this is none of your business, so just let it go. Okay, unless, of course, my mother's right. What does that mean? Kelly gave me this whole song and dance about how she wasn't in love with Joey anymore. You didn't buy it? Well, I did at first until I overheard his mom saying something. What? She told Joey that she thinks Kelly still has feelings for him. Ah, so what? Uh, you're the one with the rock on your finger. Right. But Kelly has a lot of things in the plus column. Beauty, brains, successful career, great sense of humor. You got all that. Yeah, well, she has one thing I don't. History. Kelly and Joey have been through a lot together. Didn't work out, did it? Which means you got nothing to worry about. Yeah, unless she starts digging. She is a reporter, you know. Relax. I made sure that if anyone starts digging, they'll uncover nothing. Good. Because we both know there are things to uncover. I was talking... What did Vicky say about me? It doesn't matter. It does to me. Look, you wanted to show me the magazine. I saw it. Your work here is done. Joey, I hope I'm wrong about the picture. I really do. Joey, Joey, hey, where are your parents? Brody, what's going on? You have a grandson, <gasps> and he and Jess are both doing great. <laughs> Oh, congratulations! Oh, my word, you have a grandson! Oh, how's Jessie? Is she all right? Believe me, you can handle this, Kelly. Mm, I promise. I promise. All you gotta do is keep Joey interested. I don't like that part, <laughs> but it'll be over soon. Just get what we need and disappear. I'm working as fast as I can. I know. I trust you. Then stick with the plan and meet me in Europe. I'm not leaving Aubrey. Yes, you are. You have to. We pushed our luck too far already. Don't say that. But you know it's true. I was able to keep that photo out of the wrong hands, but it was a close call. We cannot risk anyone finding out about us. Aubrey? Aubrey, are you there? Okay, okay, I know the drill. I'll be right there. Hey, I'm just getting ready for bed. How's Jessica? She's good. She's, she's good. She had a boy. Oh, that's wonderful news. Isn't it? Joey, what's wrong? So Marty's still... Is something wrong with Jessica or the baby? No. No, they're, uh, they're both fine. Then why don't you look happy? Joey, tell me. Who's the guy? <laughs>